Hello, I'm Larry Kine with CICB, the Crane Inspection Certification Bureau. We're going to tell you today about a field expedient method to use to find your sling angle factors without using any tools. Now, as we know, when we're at a 90 degree angle, there's no additional stress on our slings. And we have to account for the additional stress on our slings as our slings get closer to the horizon. At a 60 degree angle, our sling angle factor is 1.155. At a 45 degree angle, our sling angle factor is 1.414. And at 30 degrees, our sling angle factor is 2, or twice our angle of loading. Now, when your sling is in between a 90 and a 60 degree angle, our sling angle factor we're going to use is for 60 degrees, or 1.155. If our sling is between a 60 and a 45, we're going to use the factor for the 45 degree angle, or 1.414. When our sling is between a 45 and a 30, we are going to use a sling angle factor for a 30 degree, or 2. We need to memorize these numbers. Now, the tool that we can use is called Larry's Pocket Protractor. Now, we make this with just a single piece of paper. I will demonstrate. To make your pocket protractor, you simply need a piece of paper, a dollar bill, a Walmart receipt, a piece of lined paper, any type will do. When you look at it, you'll notice that each corner will have a 90 degree angle. This is your starting point. From this point, you simply have to fold the piece of paper across the corners. Think of making a paper airplane. And here is your 45 degrees. The next step is to unfold it and refold it in thirds. And there is your 30 degree angle. And if you mark the lines, you will have something that looks like this in the end. And remember, keep your slings between the angles and use the next lower angle when determining your sling angle factor. Have a great day.